92.7 WOBM, a little Lady Gaga for you on your Monday morning. It is 9.08, 36 degrees, and maybe you'll be thinking about lunch later on. We're going to talk about ways you can help out and have lunch all at the same time because it's the 8th annual month of giving with Jersey Mike Subs. And joining us right now is Kevin Smith from Jersey Mike Subs here in Ocean County, and also Tom Weatherall, who's the president and CEO of Make-A-Wish New Jersey. Gentlemen, good morning. Thanks for being in with us today. Thank you, Sean. Good morning. Good morning, Sean. Hey, Great listen, this is great. This is the eighth annual. Now, last year, I'm reading from your website, last year's month of giving with Jersey Mike's raised more than $5.5 million for local charities. Yeah. Isn't that yeah. something? That's really amazing. So, Kevin, once again, you're asking folks to come out and help a good cause out. Absolutely. This Wednesday is the, uh, the day of giving, so uh, an excellent day to come and get a sub for lunch and dinner. Uh, all the proceeds, 100 percent, is going to a great cause, Make-A-Wish New Jersey, and uh, we're really excited to be uh, partnered up with them again. And that's happening this Wednesday, March 28th. So the reason you're in Monday here now, we give you plenty of time right. to make all those dinner and lunch arrangements. <laughs> so Wednesday, it's dinner at Jersey Mike's. Uh, hopefully lunch, too. Breakfast, and lunch, lunch, and dinner. And dinner. Breakfast sure. lunch, and dinner. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Uh, Tom, tell us a little bit about Make-A-Wish New Jersey. You guys do so many great things for, obviously, a very tough situation for a lot of families when they're dealing with sickness. Well, I appreciate that, uh, Sean. Um, absolutely. You know, first of all, how grateful we are and the opportunity, uh, appreciate your covering this, this this week, Sean. Um, today's a very special day because it highlights, a, 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 the, the, although Wednesday is the day of giving, Jersey Mike's has been committing their entire month. It, March is their month of giving. Yeah. And how humble we were to be selected once again. Last year, they selected us uh, to support us here in New Jersey and many of our chapters nationally. Of that five and a half million, almost half of that million went to other Make-A-Wish chapters, including ours. It, for us here in New Jersey, helped to raise over $260,000. From, uh, from corporate and from franchise owners like Kevin Smith here who has four stores in, in, in Tom's River. Um, and those dollars, Kevin, I love the word you guys are using. It's great. It's a great partnership with Jersey Mike's, how proud mm -hmm. we are to be associated with this brand that started here, Ocean County, and has gone national much like Make-A-Wish, and, and our brand is national. And, and so it's a perfect match, and, and the pride we have here in New Jersey to be with the company that was founded here in New Jersey, those $260,000 helped us to grant 28 wishes last year. Our average wish cost is roughly $10,000. I was going to ask you that. What is the average cost is yeah. about $10,000 per wish. About $10,000 per oh. wish, and, and here's why it's so important to us, uh, Sean, is because medical studies tell us that today, that families are going to get some some very tough news. Uh, the study tells us that in throughout New Jersey, in a number of hospitals and medical facilities, blood tests are coming back. An uh, MRI, a, an X-ray um, uh, is coming back today. And at least two families are going to be told that their child has been diagnosed with a life-threatening illness that would make them eligible for our mission. And as many wish moms have told me, wish dads, um, that after that doctor uttered those words, the lips may have still been moving, but they didn't hear another word. They don't remember walking back to the car. Oh, they not. don't remember the drive home. And eventually, what we know from over now 35 years, we're celebrating our 35th anniversary this year, and almost 10,000 wishes that we've granted in New Jersey alone. That makes us one of the top chapters nationally. What we've been told is that a social worker or a child life specialist will come into that family's life in the days ahead and they will tell them of other children that they've worked with and they've seen the power of a wish impact their lives. We pick up where science and medicine leave off and what we bring is something so much more than a warm and fuzzy. We can help change that child's uh, and the family's outlook. That's what the medical community wants. They, they want a child, a, a patient, thinking positively and looking for the future. Last year, it helped us grant 28 wishes. We're hoping for that this year. It helped us set a record. So of those almost two families who will go home today, roughly 650 to 700 are diagnosed with an, uh, with an illness in New Jersey annually uh, that would qualify them for Make-A-Wish. Last year, we reached over 530 of them. We need to do better, and we need to close that gap. Um, we rely 100% on the benevolence of the community. We charge no fees to these families, and, and we, we receive no government grants. So we truly, a, a program like this, is, 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 it, it really puts the air in our sales. Your list never ends. 
well, which is it, an unfortunate situation, it, you know, too. That, that's right, Sean, yeah. yeah. There's always so a, someone out there. In where the our goal is in the next five years, and our strategic plan that our board and our staff are committed to, our donors who, who have our backs, our volunteers, we have over 400 committed volunteers statewide. We're in every, the beauty of this partnership with Make-A-Wish and, and Jersey Mike's here in New Jersey is that wherever there's a Jersey Mike store, I can assure you that within a mile, there is a wish family whose wish has been granted and impacted or a, a wish that we're, we're going to get to. That's the beauty of this. It's a hand in glove partnership uh, and one that we're wildly proud of. Very nice. Kevin, you have locations all throughout the area here, correct? Uh, Tom's River, three locations in Tom R Tom's River and a fourth one opening in the next couple weeks. Very nice. So you can hit up all the different sites throughout Tom's yeah. River and of course all over the county and all yeah. over the state as well. For folks who want to get more information, Tom, about Make-A-Wish, what's the best way for them to go about yeah, it? Yeah, sure. Hit our website, NJ wish.org uh, and, and visit us there you, you'll see donate buttons uh, we, we surely hope that you also uh, follow and, and and look for information on this program uh, at Jersey Mike's uh, before well uh, before I head back to the office after this I'll be stopping by one of Kevin's stores and picking up a 56 that's the big kahuna I'm gonna do something in the tub today hold the bread summer, summer's coming you know summer's coming gotta yeah. fit into those board shorts but uh, yeah. Um, uh, yeah you got time to work it off yeah all right all Kevin right. Kevin what do you what's the most popular sub Turkey. Turkey. Number turkey seven. is number one, huh? Turkey. Just turkey and cheese, you know, that kind of thing, or just Typically plain? turkey and provolone, and then it's a close <laughs> second with the Italian. Well, there you <laughs> go, turkey. turkey. Who would have thought? You know, it's Thanksgiving all wrong. year round. You can't go wrong. Listen, this Wednesday, have Jersey Mike's for breakfast, lunch, and dinner on behalf of your healthy child to help out those who aren't as fortunate as we are. And you know, Sean, this Wednesday, this day of giving, I've been doing this. I've been in the nonprofit space for, for north of 25 years, and I make a wish for 16, and we have one wonderful, generous partners who, who help move our needle uh, from individuals to corporations and companies. When it comes to companies, more often than not, when a nonprofit is involved in the in sales, of pro, there's a percentage of the proceeds. Mm -hmm. What makes this quite amazing, and we don't throw that word around very lightly, mm -hmm. but what makes this program amazing is that Jersey Mike's turns over their entire register, 100% yeah. of their proceeds on Wednesday. It's their day of giving. It, it really is remarkable, and, and that is amazing. we're grateful for it. Tom Weatherall, Kevin Smith. Gentlemen, thank you for being here. This Wednesday is the uh, Day of Giving. Of course, the month is all throughout the month, and you can go get more details at their website with jerseymikes.com. And your website again? Uh, NJ.wish.org. There you go. All right. Gentlemen, have a great Monday. Go get that uh, at Hoagie, and we will see you guys <laughs> here very soon. And be sure to go out to eat with Jersey Bikes this Wednesday with WOBM.